All right, so we'll walk around Spirit. This is probably a big location. It really is. Try me. Spinning. No sound, though. Should have some sound to go with it. This is realistic drilling sounds. I heard no sounds. Hmm. And here's our mask. These are your typical spirit lines. Head and hands. Uh, I didn't see much in the way of uh, Trick or Treat Studios. There are a few. They have the Michael Myers. And uh, I think stuff like this is really cool. The Vintage Wolfman. Did you slide over your face mask? Go rob a bank. And um, I believe this is actually made by a company called California Illusions or something like that. Because I've seen this packaging before. And it's a material that doesn't look like it's going to hold up over. It's like a foam. It doesn't look like it's going to hold up over a long period of time. The, the idea is sound where your mouth moves inside your chin. But uh, I just don't think it's good for the long haul. The Plague Doctor. Another fine made mask. Nice heavy duty. The prism Bull. Don't care for the prism look. Uh, I always am enamored with pumpkins and scarecrows. But there is a very nice looking scarecrow right there. And uh, that's a very nice looking pumpkin and then uh, there's a trick-or-treat studios Game of Thrones don't care for the Game of Thrones <sighs> yeah don't care for this mask don't care for that don't care for really any of those saw masks the alien looks pretty good up there very cool all right, lots of accessories. Uh, let's go have a look around. A harvester of souls right there, and uh, step on that. Look uh, at me, you know. just as all the others have. Now that I have you, your soul will be mine forever. should be happening here. There is a fog machine mechanism in here, I believe, that where they suck the fog out. There's a fan up in his mouth that pulls the fog directly into it. What it does with it after that, I don't know. Here's the uh, Jack's Cave. There. Nice, nice rat. Sewer varmint. Here is a miserable Mary right there. Let's see what happens. I'll give her a stomp on her. kind of miserable and uh, yeah here's one I think he is from the saw How pleasant. Very nice. So, curious. You see this whole setup here? They actually sell it here. It's called Jack's Cave. So there's the pricing on it. So the 3D corrugated skull with red lights, which is that guy right there, is 30 bucks. The straight curve wall, I'm not exactly sure what that is, unless it's that. Corner cave with green lights. I see. Some cups. Skulls. There's a skeleton in a bag. 
I think this is a fog machine. This is a uh, it statue tray me. I hang on to it there. It just lights up. Nice. This is kind of cute. The Sam thing with the sitting on a pumpkin. You just put a little candle light in there. Unless there's one already in there. I think there's. Oh, it's already in there. Kind of cool, huh? Sam string lights. Some holograms here. See? Got a full range of hats. Cowboy hats. Captain's hats. Top hats. Look like uh, riot gear, maybe. Oh, distressed pirate hat. Ahoy matey. Fedora. Witch's hat. Lots of wigs. Some 80s mullets. Billy Ray Cyrus right there. If you're going to go with the Joker look, there's a nice long purple jacket. A brown jacket. Maybe an inspector or something. It's also a black one. Oh, there's a chicken with a something in his mouth. Uh, he's making noise. You want to get that Indiana Jones thing going on? You got yourself a whip here. A little banjo. I don't know if it's a playable banjo. I don't hear any noise, but... Oh, there's some... Call it a mini guitar. I would call that a ukulele. Looks like they have a pretty good line of uh, appliances and makeup. You got some spirit gum adhesive and remover. Liquid latex. You can get that in large... Oh, there it is. Large quantities of liquid latex. A larger quantity, I should say. And you got your makeup. Your scar putty. Well, I don't see any makeup yet. These are all appliances for sure. Got your temporary tattoos. I got some real ones. Nails. Eyelashes. Lipstick. Uh, many of your dark gothic colors that you would need. Otherwise, need anything else, go to Walgreens or something. And here's the makeup. Glow in the dark makeup there. Lots of makeup, lots of colors. And they have some kits here. Themed kits, you know. Very cool. Very cool indeed. What do you have here? Oh, some bangs. I've never tried these. Something tells me I should give them a try. To see how they work. Hmm. Bottle of blood. Oh, there's a jug of blood down there. Cool stuff, huh? You got the blood tablets, capsules to go in your mouth. Yeah. I don't know what it's made of, but you would kind of hope that it's uh, safe to go in your mouth. There's Uncle Charlie right there. Don't worry. Won't scare me, too. <laughs> yeah, I could give you some uh, free candy. Nice. And uh, look at this. We have Jack Straw here. I don't think Jack's working. There he is. Is he gonna jump up at me? I guess not. I'm waiting. I think he's stuck. It's like a broken record. You know, the needle gets stuck in the groove. Yeah. Peekaboo clown. Yeah. Ooh, Halloween is so frightening. I can't bear to watch scary things. I'm such a sensitive soul. Perhaps you will come closer and keep away the boogeyman. 
Ah, kind of cute if you're into clowns. And here's uh, Pennywise from the It Revisited. So, uh, that's a big animatronic. It just got bigger. Hmm. Creep. Nice. And then you have uh, the demonic Dahlia. Right there. Here we go. All right. Creepy. <laughs> so you can buy the whole Reaper's Island, too. We're coming up into some Michael Myers stuff here. Trick or Treat Studios, right here. Um, these are all Trick or Treat Studios masks. Michael Myers Halloween 2. I just bought that mask for my son with the uh, blood dripping from the eyes. Got yourself a knife here. Doug, you need a knife? Yeah, maybe. Well, if you're going to go with Michael Myers, that's yeah. a good good one right there. Right. You don't want it, you don't have to buy it. Well, you know? it's just, I think it's a, I was looking it up and the Trick and Treat like Studios that. is... That's a good. That's. I, like, I love that. Does it have the helmet underneath? Yeah. yeah it's like a Much smaller. Oh yeah. Do this. Some sexy women there. I wonder if women actually look like that when they put those costumes on. Huh. T-shirts. There's a selection you get right there. Pumpkin leggings. Let's get smashed. Creeping it real. Oh, look at this jacket. Nice. That's an everyday jacket for me. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Indeed it is. This is my costume. I gotta see if I can get the... Uh Yeah, you gotta order um, from. Uh, you can order that from Trick or Treat Studios. I'll show I you. Wonder if, uh, what's in this guy? It's a super quality latex, you know, and they hold their form really well. Yeah. Look at the differences between these two. Well, remember, they're all individually painted. Oh, look at the mat. Look at the latex stuck together here. And there, see, I opened it. Yeah, it's different paint. That one looks more like the Yeah, same. you know what? They're the same grain and everything. It's just different painters. You know? Mm. This was a lot more white, and this one's kind of somewhere in the middle between the two. So that's why it's nice to have all the masks together. So you can pick the one you really want, because there's another one even. You know, that one's not. That one looks like he's packing stuff away like a gerbil. This is the best looking mask here. Yeah, it's the best looking one. I'm gonna agree with you on that. Yeah, because the film is more white. That one has the most white. You gotta make a decision. Yeah. All right, so we're leaving Spirit now. We get a couple purchases. I'll be purchasing another mask. Yeah. This guy right here. That one. And then uh, some gears. All right, we're done at uh, Spirit. That was a nice walkthrough. Yeah, Picked up a couple items, and uh, yeah. So, uh, thanks for watching my videos. Hollow about.